so I'm playing this while I'm half awake, so yay. But yep, everyone's already recognized me, nice. Oh wow, there's an actual running you can do in this fucking game. Thanks, Domas. What is going on? Yes, I love when someone is a giant ass base plate as their avatar. Wonderful. The sprinting system on here is basic as fuck. Where's the fucking blacksmith? Also, lol. Lol, the windows. I have a hard time keeping track of my quests. It's like, goddamn. You touched an infected player and received the plague. Lucky you. Oh, so I just got an egg by touching someone. Nice. I'm guessing this is like sword fighting and shit. Okay. Bro, I just want to find the fucking blacksmith. Where the fuck is he? Alright, well I guess I gotta- I'm gonna do something else because I can't figure out how the fuck to do that quest. Welcome to the rice fields. There's four different maps for this egg hunt event so and I'm assuming each map has like different eggs you can collect so if I get all of them from this map I, I'm pretty sure I would have to go through three more worlds wheat into bread the windmill helps turn wheat into bread oh can I parkour up this bitch no, I can't. I will say this map is pretty well built. Especially with how limited this goddamn client is. What happens if I go down the well? Oh, okay, there's something here. Oh, boy! Literal tide. Oh, I found an egg. Hard-boiled falls. Okay. Why is there a giant carrot? Oh, that's an egg. Nice. Who are you? You're an artist. Golden coins. Okay. So this is an egg you have to buy. You talk too much. Step away. Oh. The death threat I hear. Oh look! It looks like Stonehenge. Where the fuck is the blacksmith? I swear to god I've been looking everywhere for him. He's not nowhere to be seen. So I'm guessing this is how we're gonna get the coins. Uh, so I imagine we get wheat, convert it to bread, and then we sell it to this guy to get some golden coins and that's how we get the painted egg. Okay, what is this? Fuck. Fine. We'll choose fucking paper. Oh, it's a, a fucking course it's a tie. Fuck it. Scissors. Motherfucker. I lost. Yeah, let's choose the same thing. Insanity is choosing the same things but expecting different results. Oh, for fuck's sake. Fuck! Bruh. Oh, so one of the eggs involves you having to win a certain number of matches. Yeah, that's totally not going to be in my favor at all. I gotta use the power of my influence as a YouTuber to help get me that egg. I'm gonna be honest, that could have been designed a little better. To be honest, I think I think rock, paper, scissors is fucking stupid. I get they're trying to introduce like an element of competition, but it's like, goddamn. Okay, what is wheat and how do I get wheat? No, he just says, where can I turn wheat into bread, but how do I get wheat? That's the part I don't get. Like, is this wheat or is this a bush? I can't tell. I keep expecting that I'm able to go into buildings. Because I think there would be something in there. Uh, I think I'm gonna head over to uh, another world. Alright, so here's the next world. Scrambled Isles, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. 
I'm glad I'm in a three player server. That's reassuring. Is there one in the crow's nest? Oh, you can't even you can't even climb up the sail, rip. Okay. Oh, okay, so I'm curious how this works. Jesus Christ, just give me it, please. How the fuck am I supposed to do this in three minutes? I guess I'll have to exploit... <laughs> nice glitch, bro. I was about to say, I might have to exploit the game's mechanics if I want to get a chance to uh, beat this. Oh, did it not? Come on, game. I'm already on the one minute mark and I only have like half of them done. Yeah, th I'm not making this. Bruh! Just give me the fucking cannonball upon touch! Like, how hard is that? Like, literally, if I press fucking G on the motherfucking pirate, bam! Cannonball instant! Should not have to read through a fucking line and wait five fucking seconds just to get a fucking cannonball. It's annoying as fuck. I love exploiting glitches, though. Wow, I'm all of a sudden magically 500 times stronger. Oh my god, there we go. Jesus Christ. Literally had under 30 seconds left, and that was using glitches. Keep in mind, I, ex I had to exploit a glitch just so that way I could beat the event in time. That, that was horribly designed. Bro, I always keep wanting to go into the buildings, and then- Oh my god, I'm soft-locked. Oh my god. Why am I soft-locked? Well, it isn't Brick Hill without some place where you can soft-lock yourself, that's for sure. I had to join a new server because I was soft-locked, so that was fun. Oh, okay, there's a lot more of the map to discover, okay. Oh, look, a Venus flytrap. Okay, so I will need to find seven worms. Okay. Oh, okay, there's an egg up there. Oh, okay, there's some parkour inside. First off, what does a worm even look like? I see a pineapple in the shape of an egg. Oh, pine egg pole. Oh, okay, here we go. There, Here's the entrance. Oh, Jocelyn, of course you did. Alright, so I have the molten egg now, let's go. Uh. I still don't understand what a worm looks like. What, it, what do they look like? I'm guessing that is what they look like. I need to get a better look, though. Okay, so that's what they look like. They look like little pink fuckers on the ground, okay. Did I really just soft lock myself again? For fuck's sake. I literally soft lock myself in the du- Okay, I actually fucking broke free, thank god. Bro, why can I not find a single fucking worm on this map? It's like, everywhere I look, I don't fucking see one. In, in okay, there's another- Okay, finally, here's another one. That's the second one I found. Oh, and there's a third one. Why did you- why is there one place so closely to another? Okay, so there's three. So, okay, so I just found two that were pretty much next to each other. Okay. Oh, I see another one. Alright, there we go. So they're all really scouted in, like... A lot of them are, like, scouted in, like, one area. Okay. 
Oh my fucking god, the game crashed. Are you fucking shitting me? Please don't tell me I have to do that all over again. Please don't tell me I have to actually do that all over again. Because I will be fucking pissed. Of fucking course. And of course I have to talk to the plan again in order to start the quest. Our motherfucker, man. Alright, there we go. Speed run that dialogue. Speed run that bitch. Man, it really sucks that, like, over half of the worms for the quest are literally found in one area of the map. Like, I swear, literally I couldn't find worms for Jack, and then literally I just went to one area of the map and I found, like, over half of the worms I needed. Alright, I guess I'll talk to this guy in the meantime. Oh, they're just... Invisible walls, okay. Okay, um... Oh boy, parkour. What the f- Oh, please don't tell me this is that witch platform bullshit. I could probably sprint jump over it, though. I could cheese it. Wow, this is- This worm quest is really fucking hard to do. Jesus Christ. Like, you think they would be down here somewhere. Or on these rocks. But nope. That would just be too convenient, wouldn't it? There we go. Cheese it. Okay. So, I just found a key. Alright, well, I guess I'm gonna go back to the pirate ship. I'm guessing this unlocks the treasure. I have to use this key on something. What do I have to use it on? Is there a chest with a lock on it? Do I talk to this guy? Okay, no. Oh. I earned the Kregan. Let's go. Okay, so from what I've seen so far, most of the worms that I have found are in this area. Like, I've tried looking in every other fucking area of the map, and like, there are no worms to be found. Considering that these rooms look like they have interiors, it's like, why not just let me go in the building? Like, why not just let me in? Wait. Oh, there's one right there. Oh my fucking god. Oh, I found one of them. Oh, that is such a devious spot. Oh my god. Okay, now there's only one left. Which makes this all the more annoying. Like, I think it would be in this area. Like, that's where I think it would be. Okay, so... This is how I get the parrot egg. So, apparently it's lying around the map somewhere. Great. Now I have to find a worm and a fucking parrot. Nice. Could you go underwater? Oh, wow, you can. Imagine if the last worm is underwater. Oh, oh, okay, you drown. Oh, there it is. Alright, that, that was easy. Okay. Are you fucking shitting me? It took me four to five minutes of mindlessly walking around. And it's right fucking here. Right fucking here. Out of all the motherfucking places you could have chosen... This was the spot you had to choose? Oh, whatever. Glad I got this over with. Alright, let's go. We, we completed this world at least, so let's move on to the next world.
Alright, so this was the Arctic Research Complex, and apparently this is the most disliked world out of the four. Apparently a lot of people don't like this one. It's kind of a big map. Whoa. What up with the ground? What's, what is, what are you? A hatched penguin. Okay. Oh, you really have to sprint jump these platforms, don't you? Okay. Oh. Gee, thanks, game. Great indicator. I will say this is pro- Yeah, this is probably the biggest map out of the four. Jesus. You really have to run around a lot. I can see why a lot of people wouldn't like this. It's easy to get lost. So this is power level. This was the power level. So there's two other attributes. So C is slightly higher and A is lower. And I'm assuming that it'll unlock this door and that's how we get the power egg. Okay. Oh, okay. So these are stripes that tell you like how to access each of the end of each of the individual levers. All right. Wait for the stamina to recharge because I think you need to be running to do these jumps. There we go, yep. Alright, easy. Easy. Oh. <laughs> fuck. Well, I guess that's the only way to really fucking respond properly here. Okay, here we go. At least they have checkpoints. You know what? I'll give them credit. They at least have checkpoints. And then we go through this door. Okay. Okay, we. I guess we just go down here. Oh shit, okay. Apparently we are timed on this. Okay. Oh shit, go through here. Oh, okay. Let's go. Press E a couple of times. Alright, there we go. That should be all three of them. I've earned- oh, that wasn't the power egg. That was extreme temperatures. That's the egg I got. Okay. So, I'm guessing this one's the power egg. Oh shit! There's a laser wall! Okay. So, okay, so I just collected a battery. Alright. Up. Oh. <laughs> okay. I didn't even touch that. What the fuck? Uh, I forget. Brick Hill's fucking collision boxes are not good for obbies. Trust me, I've done Brick Hill obbies before. The hitboxes are not good. Okay, Jesus fuck. Okay, how am I supposed to get to the other side? I'm guessing I have to sprint jump up. Okay. Wait, what? I, oh, I can't just straight up jump over it? Oh my fucking god, they don't- Okay, so there's no checkpoints here. Wow, okay. Ladies and gentlemen, buckle your fucking seatbelts, because this is about to be real annoying. Oh my f- Uh, this is- Why can't you toggle fucking sprint? Like, why do I have to wait for the stamina bar to run out before I can fucking stop sprinting? Like, why can't I just toggle fucking sprint? Like, how hard is that? How are you supposed to do that jump? Okay, I can see why some people are upset about the power egg. Because Jesus fuck, this is hard. Not even too hard, it's just fucking annoying. Especially with the limitations of the sprint mechanic. Like, it gets really fucking annoying, because it really just shows 
the flaws of not being able to toggle your sprint. Like, let me toggle my sprint, please! Like, literally, I'm pressing shift and I don't stop, sh I don't stop sprinting. I didn't, oh my god, Br I fucking hate Brick Hill's hitboxes with a passion. Okay, so after stopping slightly in midair for like maybe a third of a second and then sprint jumping my way through, I managed to finally get past it. Jesus Christ, that was fucking annoying and I hated this so much. Alright, yeah, just kill me. Kill me, that's gonna make it a lot easier than you going all the way back. Alright. So that was B done. Jesus Christ, that was annoying. Alright, so here's C. Up. Oh. <laughs> oh my fucking Jesus, bro. Are you, are you serious? Wait, why is there a laser wall? Oh, for fuck's sake, you... Are we really doing a mashup of these two? Okay, I see the trick. I see the trick on how you do this one. I see the trick. Alright, so then we gotta wait... So, okay, yep, there we go, and that's how we get past C, alright. That one, that one at least had a strategy behind it, that one wasn't completely annoying. Alright. No, please don't tell me I have to make all, make it all the way back, are you kidding me? Oh, for fuck's sake. Okay. Well, at least I know the strategy. We just gotta employ the same strategy. Oh, doing that in reverse is so not comforting. I fucking hate that. Okay. Bro, I jumped! I jumped! Why didn't you jump? Oh my god. I could have made that. I could have 100% made that. I'm a fucking idiot. Okay, there we go. Jesus fucking Christ. Alright, so now that we got all three of them, where do I put them? Oh, okay, there's an entrance open now. Okay, there we go. I got the power egg. Jesus Christ. Yeah, that one was a little annoying, but overall I still managed to get it. Why can't I go through here? I just broke the game. What? Uh... I just... I just... I'm out of bounds. What the fuck? Bro, I just broke the game. Okay, so, to distinguish falling platforms from non-falling platforms, falling platforms are labeled in red and normal platforms are labeled in blue. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, so it actually gives you a checkpoint up here, so I'm not too disappointed. Okay. Um, that's another penguin egg, which I've already got before. Okay, so that's if you want to make your way down. Okay. Okay. And I need to sprint jump all the way over there. Okay. Whew. And of course I don't fucking make it. Of fucking course. A fucking course. So apparently these ones don't fall for whatever reason. Like, even though they're marked in red. 
Although it's pretty obvious which ones fall based on, like, the way that the platform's decorated. Okay, there we go. I finally made it. Jesus. Aurora Borealis. Okay. Want to help me with an experiment? Oh, great. Your target is to get your number to be equal to zero by walking on increasing and decreasing paths. Step right in by agreeing to this experiment. Will you agree we are not responsible for any casualties? That was fucking easy. Okay. Oh, okay, so there's multiple levels of this shit. Okay. Yeah, okay. That one was pretty obvious. Wait, why did it just in sharply increase? Okay. What's my current number? What? Where's my current number? Zero, one, zero, one, zero. Okay. So I'm guessing they just don't tell you anymore, but okay. One, zero, one, zero, one. Zero one, 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 zero. Oh Jesus, fuck. One zero, one zero, one zero, one zero, one zero, negative one zero, negative one zero, negative one zero, one zero, one zero. Okay, let's fucking go. This is a pretty nice view. I like this view. I wish I could actually take a screenshot of this if it weren't for my goddamn cursor. Okay, so you could. Sprint down here for something. What's what's over here? Activate the elevator E. Okay. Okay, so that was an elevator that took me somewhere. Uh, oh, there's a there's an egg up there. Oh, okay, so more part. Oh, he got himself soft locked. Lol. Well, actually, you can. Fuck. All right. After an annoying amount of minutes to get back here, I think I have an I think I have an idea of what you need to do. So, of course, you need to do this to get onto the tower. And then there's little jumps that you need to do to climb up the tower. Each of them getting slightly smaller as you get closer to the top of the tower. Uh, once you do that, you're able to get the egg. Let's go. Emergency broadcast. Or egg of scrambled signals. I think they. I think that's a, an, a mistake on uh, the behalf of the development. I think emerg emergency broadcast was the original name, but. They changed the name last second. Last second. When there are no guns in Brick Hill, why did you lie to me? <gasps> no. Gotta stop. Gun violence. Okay, you can actually go in this building. Oh, cactus egg. Surprised I didn't take damage from that. Oh, I see a tumbleweed egg. Oh, these ones move away from you. Interesting. Okay. Already got two eggs down. Let's go. Can you go get a pickaxe? Okay, so a pickaxe. She wants a pickaxe. I'm guessing that's the wanted poster. Visit the graveyard and investigate. Okay, no. Okay. I see an egg with a gun. Nice. Oh, the misery. Oh, shit. It's shooting me. Oh, fuck. I caught him. <laughs> nice. He almost killed me, too. Dynamite! Dynamite. 
Alright, so I guess we gotta find a pickaxe down here. Alright. Oh, hey look, pickaxe. I like how the, I like how as soon as I pick up the pickaxe, it all of a sudden gains much higher detail. <laughs> Here's some of what I found as a reward. I found the prehistoric egg of cracking discoveries. Okay. Rip. Oh. Oh, and that's what powdered keg is. So if you fail the challenge, you get an egg. Alright, so let's do this correctly now. Oh. Oh, I'm not supposed to stand on one either. So if there's anything I've learning so far... Oh, you took too long. What the... F Wait. But I'm down here now. Oh, there... Oh, I didn't know it was timed. What the fuck? Well, it doesn't matter anyways. I got the geode anyways. <laughs> The game was like, well, you took too long, so we're just gonna give it to you anyways. <laughs> okay, wow. Uh, <laughs> that That's the funniest outcome I've ever seen, though. That's pretty hilarious. Alright, so in order to complete this quest, what I had to do was I ended up having to go into the village... And there is this blacksmith area with, like, an anvil and stuff. And apparently if you touch the anvil, it gives you nails. And right now I'm trying to complete this quest. So that way I can, you know, get the wheat. Because this is how you get the wheat. But it, ugh, it kept cutting off abruptly. And it was being glitchy and annoying as hell. So, like... It w he wouldn't give me the Wii, so Jesus Christ. But yeah, that's how apparently you're supposed to get the Wii. Like, okay, so you go in here and you turn your Wii into bread. Alright, so now we go over to the Castle's Market and sell it for some coin, and that's how we can get the, and that's how we pay the artist for the artist's egg. Alright. Alright, so now that I got golden coins, so now we're gonna go to the artist. And the artist is what's going to... Give me the egg. 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 Apparently there is supposed to be an event in this world where you joust other people. But apparently that's broken at the moment. Like, a, like most servers actually have jousting broken at the moment, so I don't know if we're going to be able to get the egg for that one anytime soon. And that's how we got the Pisanka egg. So, egg and shiny... Okay, so, I'm getting... I'm guessing crowned yolks is, uh, what happens if you win three rock, paper, scissors games in a row, and... Well, not in a row, but win three rock, paper, scissors games, and the jousting one is, I'm assuming, egg and shining armor. But yeah, I'm gonna do both of these on a different day, because, uh, jousting right now is currently broken, and I've won a couple of games, but it doesn't, it didn't save my progress, so I CBA to play more of these games, so... Yeah, I'm just gonna call it here for now. But yeah, that's pretty much all the progress I made. I managed to actually get uh, all the eggs for two of the worlds. I managed to get all the eggs, well, all the eggs for here, and I managed to get all the eggs here. Um, I'm missing one egg here, because I ha don't have the foggiest idea of where to even start for that egg. And, um... And I don't know how, and I still don't have the two eggs here, but yeah, that's pretty much it uh, for the eggs. And apparently there's two additional eggs for, like, developers who, like, contributed to the event. And also for uh, admins and stuff, like, they can give you eggs and stuff as well. So, uh, I met Smart Lion earlier in the recording, but I didn't know that supporters could launch eggs and, like, give eggs, so I actually did not know that was a thing. 
I, ca I kind of wish I knew about that a little sooner than maybe I could have uh, given myself the, uh, the contributor's egg, but oh well. Uh, I guess that's for another day, but yeah, rip. Alright, so I'm doing this egg a couple weeks later, and I'm doing this on my Linux, so I'm not getting the true 4K. Uh, the main reason why I'm doing this is because RoboEgg wasn't officially released for, like, the longest time. Like, it took over a week for this egg to finally release. So, I wasn't able to get this egg, so, uh, now I'm do what I'm right now doing is trying to get this egg. Oh, what the hell? You can fall down there. Bro, how, how'd they be walking, though? Oh, shit. Damn, there is a lot of latency here. Oh, do I really have to run all the way back there? Jesus Christ. Would be nice if they had a freaking checkpoint here, so that way I don't have to run back here every time. I, I think I know why they probably did not release this one right away. Like, see, how am I... What am I supposed to do here? They keep fucking teleporting and shit. It's so fucking weird. <laughs> it was walking away! It was walking away! What? Oh my god, dude. The latency for this egg is gonna drive me nuts. Bro. I'm supposed to know when to dodge. That's the, that's the worst part. Okay, if, if at least you can jump over them. That's one way you can do it. Alright, so we're back on Windows. So, maybe I'll get- maybe I'll do better this time. They still move pretty fucking laggy, but I think it's at least a, a bit of an improvement. Wait, what am I doing? You know what? I- oh, I'm so stupid. I could just- I could just 180 and avoid that entire confrontation. I'm so fucking dumb. Oh, Jesus, fuck. Whew, that is some intense parkour. Okay. Okay. Alright, yes, let's go. Alright, that's it. We did it. We, we, be we got this egg. Let's go. First try on Windows. Let's go. Uh, I need to see if I can get the rock, paper, scissors egg. Literally, I've won two fucking matches before. And literally, I've it Every time I keep leaving and rejoining, it just resets my goddamn progress. <sighs> oh, for fuck's sake. The, you see why I don't fucking like this egg? This is the only reason why I don't have this fucking egg. Wait, I... Oh, I meant to hit fucking paper. What the fuck? I was supposed to say, I meant to, get, I meant to choose paper. Oh, for fuck's sake, rip. Oh, and I fucking soft blocked myself. Great. Why does this always happen? Oh my freaking god. Alright, so here is my whatever attempt of trying to get the rock paper scissors egg here's the thing i'm actually we're actually so far into the egg hunt now that pretty much most people have collected every single egg so nobody's really playing the games anymore so it's really hard to find someone to play with and uh i've actually tried to talk to a few people to help me get the egg but my friend jocelyn's on mac which means she can't play brick hill and Whenever I try to talk to other Brick Hill members to help me get the egg, 
Apparently, they can't play the game because they already got the egg. Apparently, if you already have the egg, you can't play the games anymore. And that's just fucking weird, right? Because, like, how am how are you supposed to help the other player get the egg then? Because that makes no sense. Alright, so this time I'm going to be cheating it. Because, you know what, I don't fucking care anymore. And I literally don't give a shit. I'm, just so you know, the way I'm doing this is I'm doing th this through, uh, my, I'm doing this through my laptop, so my alt account is on a completely different device, so that's how I'm able to do this with, and, like, circumvent, like, the first person limitations and all that bullshit. Another thing that's really annoying is that there is a bug, so there is an actual bug, uh, on the Brick Hill, like, Rock, Paper, Scissors event, where if you, where if you actually alternate between the red and blue platforms constantly, you actually, the game thinks that it's two separate players, and that triggers the event to start, and it breaks the event completely. I'm on a freaking laptop, and I can't even look around because... Surprise, surprise, Brick Hill's client does not support gestures for whatever fucking reason. So, I gotta go find a wireless fucking mouse so that way I can just look around the fucking place. Jesus Christ. Alright, I finally managed to find uh, a goddamn mouse for my laptop. It's laggy on my laptop as well, Jesus Christ. By the way, I can't actually get banned for this because Space Builder actually told me this technique. So, the creator of Brick Hill himself told me to do this technique, so don't ban me for this. Yay, I got the Regal Egg. I totally did not cheat it at all. Let's go. And I think jousting is broken because, of course, some jackass had to go out of their way to break the jousting event. Because watch this, if I go onto the red platform, notice that it says it's going to start the match. Notice that it says it's starting the match, even though it doesn't say, oh, you need one more player to do this. So, yeah, th this event's fucked. It's broken. And the, the, the most annoying part is there's always some dumbass, like, dummy account that just sits in the fucking server doing nothing... And basically, it fucks it up because it doesn't give a chance for the server to restart, so that way I can get the fucking egg. This happened earlier today, which is why I couldn't record this earlier today. Because some fucking jackass just kept sitting in the server and literally idling, so I couldn't fucking- I couldn't get into a new server with the events that work. Like, watch this. It doesn't even show on the fucking screen. It... Like, the event is completely fucked. It's broken. I like how on my screen, he's still holding the sword, but on... On, uh... My laptop screen, I'm not holding the tool at all. That's... that That's just hilarious. Wait, I'm just curious. Since I have the egg, I still can play, right? Oh, so they fucking lied to me. So, whoever came up with the fucking rumor that you can't play this game anymore after you come play the egg, you're a giant fucking liar. But yeah, I'm gonna have to wait a little bit and then try again because some jackass broke jousting and now I can't fucking play jousting because uh, it's broken. So yeah, that's, that's just fun. All right, here we go. So, uh, this is me recording this a couple of hours later. This is on a fresh new server, and as you can see on the screen, uh, this game is working like it should be, so I'm going to be getting my old account on here right now, and then, uh, I'll hopefully be able to get the Egg of Shining Armor. Again, I'm fucking cheating this one, and I don't give a shit because I've done literally everything I can and nobody wants to fucking help me, so this is what I have to do. Okay, so do I just click on the dude? Okay, I just click on them. Okay. 
I wonder why you have to only win one game to get Egg and Shiny, but you have to win three Rock, Paper, Scissors games to get the... the Crown Egg. Like, I don't know. I just find that very weird. But anyways, I got all the eggs in this, wor uh, this world. Uh, there is only one more egg that I need to get that's left, and that is the Contributor Egg. And I think I know who to contact to get this egg. So give me a couple of minutes while I get that arranged. Here I am, abusing connections to literally get this last egg. <laughs> Alright, it took quite a bit of time, but uh, he's gonna be joining the game any minute now. Alright. So I managed to contact Space Builder, and he's going to give me the final egg that I need for... Well, at least part one of this event, because uh, there is supposed to be a part two to this event. And uh, that is going to be when this event concludes itself. I probably will get started in, uh, in the meantime working on the... Uh, what you might call it? I should probably get wor started on the egg hunt video, uh, and probably do that. All right, yay, he's here. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the other guy who's in this server is like, "What the fuck is that space builder, bro? You call me a loser." <laughs> but yeah, that that's pretty much it uh, for part one.